Now this one, painted in army combat green, may be mistaken as being a German army buckle, but it actually isn't. It's been reissued to the army, but when we look at the back, we'll see that it's had an interesting life. This particular one, it's a one piece stamped buckle. When we turn it over, we see that it's sand underneath. So it's been issued to the Africa Corps, then to the army, but the underlying metal of the buckle is brass. So the buckle originally started out life as an old brass Kriegsmarine Navy buckle, then it's been issued to the Africa Corps as an army buckle, and then it's been reissued back out again as a combat painted army buckle. Because the design on the same on the front is exactly the same as what you find on an army buckle. So that's had a bit of an interesting reissue life. So it's a navy buckle that's gone to the Africa Corps and then to the army. And again, it's a no maker mark one. 